Okay, so I had to stop the video for a minute, but all right, guys, we're back with another Hot Wheels collection here that will be for sale. There will be uh, quite a few mystery models. I have a pretty big box here of different ones. Um, some of these will be given away, some will be sold. This is not even just the tip of the iceberg. Like, I have some that's been collected ever since, like, before I was born, and some while I. Um, was like a toddler. My dad was collecting from different places, and um, uh, thank God that there are a lot of them are around today. Um, <clears throat> so I'm gonna start off with this box. Guys, excuse the rug. I gotta back it. So I'm gonna start off with a handful. Of this. So this isn't too. I mean, it's cool. Like a lot of these different ones in here are gonna be like something that look weird like this this is a chevy right here a 83 chevy like it's a tuned one like oh let me get it to focus like i mean it's it's pretty cool it looks odd because it's like it's smaller than the regular hot wheel so we got this one we got uh this one right here i mean it's a night rider car i mean it's okay you know like it's cool I try to collect <clears throat> like the real ones like right here like my father my father's father had a Corvette similar to this but it's all silver um, and it's pretty cool this is a real um, real life Corvette it's a Chevy anything that's kind of like a real life car I try to collect or trade or whatever you know this is pretty cool um, this, some people said this was a pretty hard one to find, the Skyline, um, I mean, this is pretty cool, that's a real vehicle, um, I have another one right here, I got a few Skylines and a few Supers around here, yeah, I mean, they're, they're all different, like the Aston, Aston Martin here, um, all different ones. Got the uh, Nash. It's hard to find in that. Some of these is cool. I mean, I know it's Batman, but you know, hey, it's okay. I have a gold version of this around here too. Um, I know it's pretty cool. Batman TV series. The old one was uh, <clears throat> pretty cool. So that's another one of the rare Hot Wheels ones I uh, just pulled out of the pack. One of the ones I've never seen before. I'm going to save that for another video. Actually, anybody purchased anything from me, I have several of the non-seen before Hot Wheels. Um, that's in the packaging. Not like these. That's in like the packaging on the card, but they're new in the pack. And they're pretty decent. So, here's a Toyota Supra right here. We got the uh, old Camaro, of course. Got a few different Camaros around here. Uh, this one I found a few days ago. It's pretty cool, but I could count on one hand how many times I had a funny car. Um, I have an all metal one. Uh, I think it's by Hershey's, but it's pretty cool. Um, these aren't like the old ones I was talking about, like my uh, dad had, you know, coming up. I've seen this van several times. I said, you know what? Let me just grab one of these. I don't really have many vans. Um, this Toyota van is a real life vehicle. This Cadillac, I'm not really big on Cadillacs, but this Cadillac Seville is a um, real life car as well. And yeah, I mean, to each his own. Whatever people want to collect it by. Like, I usually brought these right here um, for like. If, like, some of my younger siblings come over, and this is pretty cool because you can feel the brill. I mean, um, you call that, um, brill, I think. Yeah, the brill. Um, but like, people that are blind, I figured this was pretty cool. There's a twin mill. I like that. Here we go, all life real cars. 
I don't really like the paint scheme on some of these, but this is pretty cool. You know, it was a hard to find one. The uh, Camaro. You got the uh, Tri 5 Terra. The gasser here. I got uh, quite a few gassers hanging on my wall. And once again, back to the Corvette. These are pretty cool. Once again, they're real life vehicles. Now, okay, this one is empty. You got a Batmobile here. I mean, it's pretty cool. I like them. Um, I mean, I'm not crazy over there, but I try to stick to like the real life vehicles, like this right here, the Honda. Um, excuse me. <coughs> like these are like real life vehicles. It's not overdone for us to paint the stickers, none of that. Like it's pretty cool. I like them. Like I said, once again, stuff like this, I would try to get for like, uh, like little kids, you know, family members, they come over and study them, trying to, like, tear into something like this, or they're trying to tear into something like this or something, instead of them tearing into something like this that's more aimed at adults that you might not want to open, you know, they have something like this. I mean, these are pretty cool. Anybody can collect any con that they want, but stuff like this, like a kid, you wouldn't mind. Oh, go ahead, tear it open, you know, have fun with it. Or even something like this. This is a matchbox. I'm not trying to get off the Hot Wheels subject, but it's pretty cool. It's like a street sweeper. I actually made one of these RC along with a rollback some time ago. Um, I mean, once again, we got another Batmobile pretty cool looking you know it's all right but back to the real life cars i actually raced against one of these firebergs in real life i raced my uh 92 camaro rs 25th anniversary on uh 695 north against a red one of these a real car um he's pretty fast doing fast enough and uh you got your Dodge Viper right here. This is a real car. Both of these. One's a Chevy. One's a... I mean, sorry. Mm, excuse me. <laughs> these resemble a Camaro a lot. So I, call, I tend to call these a Chevy. My fault. You have the Firebird here. All right. I mean, um, they're kind of in the Chevy family a bit um, for certain models because it kind of look like a Chevy. But they do have... I remember I needed a spindle and I had went to the junkyard because some of them were harder to find. I got a spindle, like you could use some of the same parts on a Firebird and on a Camaro, so they're kind of the same. But, um, you know, either way, Firebird is pretty good, especially the 5.7, like the one from uh, Smokey and the Bandit. That car is pretty cool. Um, uh, it's just like a little Chinese truck right here. It's pretty cool. I like it. Um, then, of course, you have the uh, Nissan here, which is pretty pretty cool. So you got both of these trucks. One's a little more chroma than the other. Yep. And um, you had, like I said, the, the Nissan here. Um, I actually, some time ago... It's a towed a, a truck, a box truck. This guy had several Hot Wheels in it. And I offered me a few. Some are real, like, older and, you know. But here got another real vehicle right here. Uh, Thunderbird, for Thunderbird right here. And, um, I mean, my brother had one of these, I think, years and years ago. A real one, you know, pretty cool. Then you have the McLaren, the Ford GTR, pretty cool. GT, Ford GT. Those are like all real vehicles, and then you have your uh, Bentley here. Um, that's pretty cool with the race wing on there. Um, be cool without it, but either way, it's still cool. It's a, it's a Bentley, you know. Then you got your uh, Toyota here. It's pretty cool. Got a couple of those. You have your uh, Dodge Express truck here. Little smokestacks on the side. Then 
Um, you got your Lamborghini Hurricane Coupe. And like I said, all of these are like adult cap. So you gotta worry about no children playing with these. Got your Gumball 3000, which is for GT40 right here. Another uh, Nissan GTI. And then once again, this is something like I would give like a kid right here. Um, because I mean, it's cool, but uh, once again, you buy can collect these. They collect whatever they want. However, I just seen it. It's looked pretty cool. Um, you know, as well as this right here. I mean, the mad splash. Like, who cares if a kid open this and just broke it? I mean, you know, it's aimed more towards children. Okay. Then. If there's any Mustang fans, we got some Ford Mustangs here. We got this old vintage one. Uh, this one modeled after like the Fox body. You got your convertible. Um, you got the, these two down here. The Barch one boss. They're pretty cool. Um, another Batman Forever Batmobile right here. Right. Then. Something I would uh, uh -oh, put my camera. Once again, this is something I would give to a kid right here. Um, you know, like they're pretty cool. They're still new in the pack, but something I would like give to like a kid. You know, I'd have been in the store and seen not this con right here, not the Toxic Creatures version, but like I've seen like the Mustang version and like other ones where like some cars are just gone, like. Not that high, people. Just buy them. <coughs> Excuse me. Um. So like the the Bel Airs and stuff like that, like the, like things like a Gasser, the heck of the black version, the heck of like the bubblegum pink version is pretty cool. Then you got your custom Camaro right here. Um. Like I'm just a fan of like Camaros, cause like in real life. My first ever vehicle was a tow truck to make money. And I remember I was going to go pick my friend up. Uh, I used to go to school with from uh, his house so he can make some money with me. And I seen a Camaro, not nothing like this. Like I said, my, my Camaro that's parked outside is a 92 RS 25th anniversary. And um, I just fell in love with it. First um, thing I brought was a tow truck, then two motorcycles, then older muscle car just parked in the corner with my name on it i loved it and you got this one called the lightning bug right here it's like an x racer x ray racers right here so i mean it's pretty cool um once again you know aimed at like a kid or anybody that wants them um this right here like you can see like they just picked a few cars up out of here that they wanted so i said yeah go ahead you know and that's what they wanted so uh the mickey mouse boat i just i remember the cartoon that was in black and white so i did pick this one up this is pretty cool the disney steamboat then this right here once again aimed at adults the 70 chevy chevelle i got two chevelles around here all new on the card um this is pretty cool as well uh this right here the Formula Solar is pretty good. I like them. Um, I would do that. Then, of course, your 68 Mercury Cougar. Um, that's pretty cool. Uh, Bone Shaker by Moonies. That's, that's pretty cool, too. Um, then you have. 69 Shelby GT 500 that that purple is pretty cool it pops in the, the, the light you got the uh, 52 Chevy right here which which is pretty uh, decent as well I like that then speaking of pickup trucks you got your 67 Chevy C10 which is pretty awesome I got a few pickup trucks around here as well.